The men's soccer team gets the win versus UMass Lowell by a score of 1-0. Eddie Bogle scored the only goal off a corner kick header being assisted by Zach Zarita in the 75th minute. That was Bogle's first goal on the year. Um, well, Zach played a, ball, a wonderful ball for me to score and I was determined to score for my team to win because this is a season opener, game opener at home. So we needed a win for a coach and I was determined to score that goal. How does it feel getting your first goal on the, on the year? Well, it feels good, so now uh, goal is going to come like rapid, you know, like goals after goal. So that's my goal. I'm a senior, so I have to show up every game, try to win for this season and go to the conference and win it, hopefully. Goalie Joseph Abeli and the rest of the defense made some key stops to complete the shutout. You know, that's what we work on every team. You've got to be solid at the back if you want to win games, you know, and we haven't conceded the goal in you know, the past couple of games now, which is a good sign. And, uh, you know, we've just got to learn to put the ball in the back of the net, but the lads at the back have been solid. And uh, if we can keep that going, we can have a really good season. How does it feel getting that first win, especially being at home in front of friends and family? It's great. It's, it's what we've been working for, obviously. Um, we've had five away games in, in a row, which is, oh, it's been enjoyable, but it's been tough as well. And, you know, this is where we love playing in front of our own fans and, you know, to get the win, uh, no matter how we got it, is a good feeling. For you as a coach, how does it feel getting that first win under your belt for the year? Oh, it's great. I mean, nothing uh, uh, does a team better than a, than a good win. Uh, you know, you could have 12 great practices, but one win is better than 12 great practices. And it was. I mean, I, lads have worked very hard. Um, we've played against some of the best competition in the Northeast with, you know, West Virginia. They just beat the national champions 5-4 last weekend. And then we played Penn State, who were the Big Ten champions last year. And then straight after that, we played UMBC, who were the American East champions, who were top 25 team. So it was good to get home, kind of play the team that in the same weight class as us, the same level of us. We felt as a team we could beat, but uh, it was a great open match. It was end-to-end, -end. it was entertaining for the crowd. Both teams were creating opportunities. So I'm glad you know, not one team just come out and play defense. We both came out to try and win this game tonight. Uh, your defense, how they played, you know, there were some cl couple close calls down there. Explain how they did it today. Yeah, well, I mean, we've went uh, now f over 300 minutes and only conceded one goal, which is pretty good. Um, so it's two shutouts in a row for the team. And uh, I think Connor Qualter has been unbelievable. He's been the, the anchor of our defense. He's a freshman from England. Um, just been, he's played well beyond his years as a player. He is a freshman, but he's a big leader back there verbally. And two great stops that he had in this match. You know, point black shots at goal, and he put his body in the way. And he did a great job. So I think Connor Qualter was absolutely the, the greatest defender for us tonight.